What you gonna do? What are your plans? What company are you applying to? What's next? Oh my gosh, it's crazy Panicville out there! What's up everybody? Like you, I also heard a couple of weeks ago about the online ESL platforms basically crashing and phasing out over the next several months. And many have asked me what I'm doing through all this and what this is going to look like for me after I've put several years into online ESL teaching, working with companies in China and helping many teachers get hired with companies. So what am I doing? What are my plans? In this video, we're gonna talk about it. If we're meeting for the first time, my name is Tim. You can find me over at onlineteacherdude.com and I would encourage you to head on over there and check out one of my latest blog posts which gives you some information all about some non-Chinese companies that are hiring as well. You can check out this video. So number one, I'm going to keep on teaching. I'm thinking of the Finding Nemo, right? Keep on swimming. Just keep swimming, just keep swimming, just keep swimming, swimming, swimming. What do we do? Keep on teaching, keep on teaching. I'm gonna keep on teaching until the very end with VIP Kid. I have been faithful to them and loyal to them since I started with them and they have been the company that has allowed me to, you know, just create so much opportunity in my life. And I love my students. I'm going to continue to teach until the last student I have has their last class. That's me though, that may not be you. Some of you may not want to bear, you know, having to say those perpetual goodbyes when class is finished for your students. And I totally get that. If you want to be like, hey, I'm out now. I'm going to get out while it's good. I'm going to get out while it's hot. I'm going to get out while I'm feeling good and while I'm, you know, booked or whatever. That's totally fine. Do you, I don't got time for this. Do you, boo-boo? It, it is what it is for different people, right? And I respect your decision, and I'm just telling you what I'm doing. I am not going to panic apply to 30 plus companies that are outside of China. I have talked about companies outside of China on my channel, but I'm not going to go and apply to all of them. And I'm not following Facebook groups where everybody is talking about companies after companies after companies. That makes me feel anxious. That makes me feel nervous. You know what else? It makes me feel like, I'm at the back of the line and everybody is getting hired with companies before me. I want to tell you something. That is not true. It does not mean that you are behind or that you are late to the party, okay? I want you to know that, that if you're not willing and wanting to apply to dozens of companies, then don't. I'm certainly not. I realize that it's not possible for some people to keep teaching with their current company. <clears throat> go, go, kid and others that have also closed their doors suddenly. I get it, but this is what I'm doing. Instead of mass applying to company XYZ and Panda ABC and Kid123, I am going to be spending the next several weeks, maybe even months, doing my research because these companies are not going to close their doors overnight. But I'll tell you one thing, they are going to be saturated with applications right now. So I'm going to be doing my research and I'm going to apply to two to three companies. I will let you know what they are when I apply and I'm going to take my time with it. I'm going to get my resume together, I'm going to get an intro video together, and I'm only going to apply where I see myself working and where I think it's a good fit for me. I hear a lot of teachers saying, I want to find a company exactly like VIP Kid that pays me the exact amount of money that they paid me and has the exact same hours and it gives me the same kind of flexibility and freedom. You're looking for a unicorn. It might be out there, absolutely. but you might have to start working for a company that is a little bit less desirable. Maybe the pay is not so good, or maybe there's a, a required number of hours per week. So just be aware of that as you're looking for non-Chinese companies, if that's what you're looking for. Maybe you wanna go and work at Starbucks, and I would give you a high five for that. There is nothing wrong with getting a job, a brick and mortar job that will pay your bills in the meantime, while you look at other things. There's lots of work at home opportunities that you can explore, those take time to build up, and to you know get into. So if you wanna go find something like working at Walmart or going back to a substitute teaching job or even a full-time teaching job, more power to you, I will be cheering you on. The next thing that I'm gonna be doing is building up my private teaching business. Now, on the side, for the last 11 years, I have had students that I have taught privately in China mainly. 
And this is because I, I lived in China and I brought a couple of students with me when I moved to Malaysia eight years ago. And one of those students has been with me the entire time. But over the years, I've had referrals from different students and I've taught probably, you know, less than five students um, regularly on an ongoing basis. Sometimes I've only had one or two and sometimes I've had three or four. So um, at the moment I have three students that I teach privately and this is something that I'm going to be putting more work into and building that up to be a little bit more consistent. I don't want to have uh, 10 or 15 students. Uh, I, I don't have time for it to be quite honest, but I do want to put some more effort into building that up and sharing resources and ideas for you if that's the route that you would like to go and if you would like to build up a private tutoring or private teaching business as a freelancer for yourself, which is possible. And you can control your hours, you can control your pay, and you can control who you teach. So there's a lot of flexibility in that. And as well, going along with that, I am going to continue to show up and create content for online teachers like you. Just because these companies have closed their doors and my channel was built, in the beginning around companies like VIP Kid and GoGo -Go Kid and Magic Years, it has evolved into so much more. I've been talking about, you know, building your business. I've been talking about teaching privately. I've been talking about diversifying for months and maybe even more than a year. And so I'm excited to continue to show up and bring you valuable content to serve you and help you if you are in a position where you're looking to diversify your income and build up your teaching business. As well, I'm going to be taking some time over the next several months to work on projects. I have lots of little projects and loose ends that I wanna tie up. One of them being my website. I want to take that through a, a new redesign and to kind of give it a bit of a facelift. I also want to do some work behind the scenes on my YouTube channel to update things now that a lot of Chinese companies have shut their doors. And I want to continue to, you know, to grow as an entrepreneur and invest in myself so that I can invest in you. And I will be putting some time into working on projects behind the scenes to better serve online teachers. You will know that I have a couple of courses. I have my free bootcamp course, which is linked up here, and my website in a weekend course, which is also linked somewhere up here or down there. I don't know, see where I can put it. Um, and I wanna go into those courses and make some updates. By the way, if you are a student, you will get all the updates for all those things because once you are a student in one of my courses, you will always have access to it. Finally, I'm here for you. If you've got questions, if you want to vent, if you are struggling, if you don't know what your next move is, if you are, you know, wanting to talk to somebody, shoot me an email and I'll do my very best to help and support you. And I thank you so much for being here again on another video. Thank you to everyone for supporting this channel and I look forward to the future and I really hope that you are as well. So that's what I'm doing everyone or what I think I'm doing moving forward. I don't know, maybe you'll find a new YouTube channel where I'm promoting some MLM scheme. It sounds like a get rich quick scheme. Yes, thank you. You will get rich quick, we all will. No, I won't be doing that, don't worry. <laughs> this is what I'm thinking about doing right now and uh, what my plans are moving forward in the next few months. So I wanna know what you're doing. Let me know in the comments below. What are your plans? I look forward to hearing from you. See you next time. <laughs>